Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Try Play, a different kind of let's play where first impressions really matter. My name is Alex and for once I'm kind of decided to go back to Persona 5. You know, normally we feature brand new gameplay here on Try Play, but I wanted to basically honor one of the best games of 2017 by giving it its own Try Play. So, why don't we just start it, shall we? Oh, here we go. Here's all the freebies. They gave out a lot of freebies, like, in this game. Including, like, a Japanese voiceover option, which, you know, that's really fantastic. This story is a work of fiction. Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. Oh my. I agree. The contract has been sealed. The world is not as it should be. It's filled with distortion, and ruin can no longer be avoided. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. This is so exciting. It's... I don't normally get to play a lot of these games, like, again, you know? And Persona 5 is definitely one of those games that just pure production value, presentation, voice acting, you name it. It's like... It sets... A really high bar for a lot of JRPGs out there. And by the way, in case people were wondering, I've been playing Persona games since Persona 3, so... And actually, even further back, Persona 1. Revelations Persona on the PlayStation 1. I had that. I bought that game. That's us! Listen to that music. It's pretty groovy. I mean, the setup for just the story is really brilliant. Good. Now get running. This is our only chance. Stay calm. You can get away now. We'll retrieve the briefcase on our end. Yikes. They're on to us. Hmm? Who's that? Don't worry about us. Just concentrate on getting away. But I have to say, showing yourself above that crowd earlier was an Man, that music is so good. Shoji Meguro is the man. Oh man, we, we actually like got here sooner than the dialogue uh, permits, actually. Take him down, Joker! <laughs> Alright. Kablamo! So in case you haven't played Persona 5, it isn't a traditional menu-based system anymore. There's like actual face buttons that are mapped to different commands. And I think it's actually really, really intuitive that way. Actually, let's do Brave Blade. Wow. Can you say own? Yeah. 
Yikes. I remember when, before this game came out, a lot of people were actually really worried about the stealth elements of the game, because this is the first Persona that actually had, like, you know, I guess, quote-unquote, stealth, you know? Okay. Should be able to get out that way. Hurry. Come on, man. Dude, can you even hear us? I'm okay. Don't worry. I'm picking up everyone's voices. Just go, Joker. <laughs> I know, I'm trying to do voices too. Oh my god. This is gonna be crazy. Okay, that's not the right way. There's so much mystery to this game. No wonder Atlas actually wanted to kind of, you know, put like a media blackout on this game. Like there's so much suspense, so much mystery. I can kind of understand that. Still, blocking it from streaming is kind of bad news. Yeah. Run for the stairs, buddy. And shout outs to Persona 5 for actually hitting that magic 2 million sold, man. I'm kind of curious. What is everyone's favorite JRPG for the people who are listening? Place it in the Something comments wrong? below. The exit should be up ahead. You're there. That's just how it is. For me, After like commotion, the bottom floor probably have to be Final Fantasy, down. like the original. Hey, can you make it? Like the Over NES. There. There's no way to run. Uh oh. He talks! Most protagonists in Persona don't talk. You're so reckless, you know that? Look at this slick guy. Pimptagonist. Enemies here? What's wrong? These readings. It can't be! What happened? Yikes. Joker, can you handle this? Joker! That's a lot of freaking people, man. Oh, crap. That's a lot of soldiers, man. Those aren't just cops. Didn't expect to find some kid. You have your teammate to thank for this. You were sold out. Dun dun dun! Mystery desu! Ha, P5. I see that. I never noticed that, like, when they're taking your mug shots and stuff, the first two letters were basically P5. Oh, letters and numbers, you know. You, you get the drift. Guess the drug was too strong. Wake him up. Dang. No dozing off. How did he get back to his Still old clothes? It, do you? Give it up. Oof. Come on, cooperate. What? You want another shot? Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? Hmm. Of course not. So you're not that dumb, which is good, because we get to take as much time as we need. Oof. 
I guess it makes sense for him to kind of wince in pain. <laughs> it would be weird if he just didn't say anything. Manslaughter too, yeah? Talk about the works. To think that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And you seem to be enjoying every second of it. I don't think he's actually enjoying it. He's kind of crying too. I was enjoying it? Everything's hazy. I can't remember. Normal. Come on. To try play. You should know your place. And the, yeah, that's why I picked normal. Is that why you're saying that? I ain't, I ain't in it for the uh, the punishment. Sign here. It's a confession under your name. I understand. Shing. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. We're going to make you our bitch. This game is really harsh at the very beginning. And I'm not talking about like harsh as in like difficulty, but if you get triggered by a lot of, you know, a lot of things, I would probably caution people to try and maybe I don't know. Be more aware about like what the game has. It's not as cheery as the previous games, I'll tell you that much. But in case you're wondering like what name we're gonna be giving our protagonist for this this try play, well, it's a name that my girlfriend and I gave to the main character when we were playing it. So Morgan Freeman. That is my name. I'm finished. Hi. My name is Morgan Freeman. This is my story. Now, I don't know how my Morgan Freeman voice me, is, but, but is off. hopefully it's passable. I'm Nijima from the public prosecutor's office. The prosecutor's office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. Can you imagine all this is suspect. because of a kid Nijima, in sorry. high school? I, this I mean, most no of the Persona games have been Besides, set in high school. Well, actually, all of them have been set in high school. Nijima. But some of the characters aren't, aren't necessarily director. high school students. Persona 2, for example, you both games. Not necessarily a high school student. I thought I ordered you to stand by. And in case you're I'm wondering, there are two Persona 2s. There's Sin and Punishment. In interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Okay. Uh, good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much, though. Uh, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> it's for your own sake. I'm not going to say anything unknown. that will all, spoil the game, but it's, it's, it, speak with him. this game is pretty dang intense. Like, with emotionally and psychologically and stuff. There's a little bit of tough points in the game, especially with how people you. treat you. You'll be answering my questions this time. <sighs> Those bastards. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here. And I can't stop them. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go. Jeez, <laughs> let me answer the question, lady. Because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. Of course you couldn't. <laughs> True. There's no way I could be convinced of such a world just by reading the reports. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. Start from the very beginning. And this, my friends, is where the game officially starts. You are
were held captive. A prisoner of fate to a future that has been sealed in advance. This is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. I beg you, please overcome this game and save the world. I do love that they put the butterfly, which has been kind of like the staple of Persona games for a long time, you know, back on the forefront in the narrative. You know, like, Persona 3 and Persona 4, the, the butterfly was there for, like, save points and not too prominent. But in this game, it's like, well, bam, narrative device. What is the butterfly? Would you like to save? How about no? Yes. <laughs> We're not gonna do that. This is a tri-play. Why do we need to save? A little bit of trivia. Production IG, who's responsible for a lot of like high profile animes out there, you know, is responsible for some of the cutscenes in this game. They do fantastic work. Whoa! Damn brat! I'll sue! Yikes! What? Are you for real? A mental shutdown? It's the truth! To a person though? It's gotta be a joke. Also, I like I really even the detail on the subtitles. <laughs> like, it's not just your run of the mill, like you know, like, serif font. It's, like, stylized. They certainly put a lot of work into, like, their presentation and everything else. It's really cool. And look, it's Shibuya. Now, what would you do if that happened on your phone. I would just turn it off. Rise, I see you! And Kanamine Kitchen. Shoutouts to Kanamine Kitchen. Oh no. That sounds like... That looks like bad news. Well, sounds and looks like bad news. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Trash can. That's what I would do. But moreover, I think I would shut off the phone. Well, actually, no, I can't because I'm actually trying to get to, you know, to my new home. Hints. You're confused about things. Blah, 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 blah. There are, there's a quest marker. There you go. Oh, man. Japan. I miss Japan. I actually traveled to Japan about three times. Like, over the course of the past few decades. It's quite the different culture. Starting today, Sojiro Sakura will be taking care of me. His house should be in the back streets of this residential area. Alright, Morgan. It's time. We know exactly where he lives, so we'll just go right there. The nameplate here says Sakura. It looks like it might be Sojiro Sakura's house. Even after ringing the doorbell, it doesn't look like anyone will answer the door. Maybe he's gone out. Looks like no one's home! Oh yeah! 
Sakura-san's usually at his cafe around this time. Well, LeBlanc's in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. Mm, next, I need to take this package to... Mumble, mumble. Whoop. I'm not gonna listen in to people. What kind of person would I be? I do love it when, like, people are- people just fade in the closer you get. It's really cool effect. It looks like this place is LeBlanc. I'll go inside. Somebody actually found, like, where this place actually is, because this isn't, isn't really a real place. But, obviously, something inspired them to make this area. was driven down an opposing lane with its customers still in it. The citizens can't live in peace if this keeps up. Oh, how frightening. What could be going on? Didn't something similar happen just the other day? Well, this isn't a happening place. Hmm. Vertical is the name of a shellfish used for farming pearls. I don't know what that is. Oh, right. They did say that was today. Man, attitude so already. Now the payments on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. Oh, gee, thanks, what old now? man. There's been a string of those rampage accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. It's none of my concern. Dang. <laughs> well, see you next time. Cold. It's none of my concern. Oh. Four hours for just a single cup of joe. So, you're the guy. Please take care of me. Uh-huh. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. But you're the one, huh? I'm a good kid! Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other. And, well, not that that matters. Follow me. Hmm. So it's like an offer to like shelter him and stuff. Okay. This is your room. I'll at least give you sheets for your bed. This is a dump. You look like you want to say something. It's big. It's on you to clean up the rest. I'll be leaving after I lock up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. This is what I was talking about earlier. Some now, of the people here are very aggressive towards you. Situation. You protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her. He got injured, then sued you, right? That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. The courts ordered you to transfer and move out here. Which your parents this whole thing sounds like the first page of a choose your own adventure book. <laughs> it's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. Behave yourself for the year. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. A whole year. Cause any problems, and you'll be sent straight to Juvie. Jesus. We're going to Shujin tomorrow. Shujin. Shujin Academy, the school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place to accept someone like you, you know? What a waste of my Sunday. Jeez. Your luggage arrived earlier. I left them over there. All right. Well, this is the first day of the rest of my life. I'll be living here, starting today. I should check out what's in here. It's the cardboard box sent from back home. It's full of clothes and daily necessities. I'll change no more comfortable clothes for now. Yeah, look at that! pimp antagonist. I guess I should clean the room while I'm organizing things. There are all sorts of unused household items lying here. It's not organized at all. Why don't you clean? It's a table covered in dust. I draw a line in the dust with my finger. 
it'll probably be really easy to see. Why don't... <laughs> why don't you just start cleaning? I should start cleaning first. That's what I was trying to do! Jesus, man. You're making it really difficult for yourself. It's late. Seems like I've been cleaning for a while. Seriously? What the heck? I heard you making all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. Uh -huh. Actually, the place doesn't look too bad. Though it's only natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. Why don't you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to be doing, right? I'm gonna close up shop and get out of here myself. I'm gonna head back then. I won't be the one looking after you if you get sick from staying up too late. You got that? Yeah, sleeping in bed, how to advance time, and blah de blah de blah. So let's just sleep. Starting today. This is my room. Arrest. Trial. Criminal record. Damn brat! I'll sue! Still, I couldn't just let that go. <sighs> that day, I had to go home early. I can hear a man and a woman arguing in the distance. I think they're just up ahead. See? Everything is better with Morgan Freeman's voice, right? Even when things get rough. Don't give me that shit. It looks like that drunk man is bothering that woman. Please stop! She's in danger. I can't ignore this. Because I am Morgan Freeman. Time. This is my life. Me trouble, huh? uh, I'll call the police. Call them if you want. The police are my bitches. They're not gonna take Damn. Me seriously. Really? No. Stop. That's quite a tall order, buddy. Someone called the cops, huh? Get in the car. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. Hmm. What are you looking at? Get out of my face. This ain't a show. Get lost, kid. See? This is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car. So this is basically what started everything. <laughs> hmm, it's that weird app that somehow sent ended up on my phone. The icon looks almost like an eye. It's so creepy. <laughs> my eyelids are starting to get heavy. Love the art style of this game. Like, there's that really crisp, like, punk aesthetic. It's really cool. I'm a stickler for presentation, by the way, in case people don't know. There are some video games that are so lazy when it comes to presentation. And by that, I mean, like, the user interface, you know, not stylized with the game and all that stuff. Don't worry, Morgan Freeman. We will free you. 
in another lifetime. Because this is a tri-play, and we only have an hour. And sadly, this game is way longer than that. <laughs> Did you guys catch the uh, letters on both of these uh, girls' like hats? Trickster, welcome to my velvet room. What a deep voice. <sighs> You've come too, inmate. The you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight. Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality. You know what's really crazy about his voice is it's so filtered. That you can actually, if you're wearing headphones, you can kind of hear the distortion. The master of this place. Remember it well. I summoned you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. Important matters. Still, this is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Worry not. There is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be rehabilitated. Rehabilitated toward freedom. So for context, the Velvet Room always changes form. Freedom. Sometimes it's not even really a room. In Persona 3, it was an world. elevator. In Persona 4, it's a limousine. Because that guy is the true pimp of the series. You dig? I'd rather avoid ruin. Allow me to observe the path of your rehabilitation. Ah, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justi. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like! The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. That is, if you remain obedient. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. In many, many instances. Now then. It seems the night is waning. It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. Time's up! <laughs> now hurry up and go back to sleep! I'll let you guys figure out, like, what those, you know, what those letters are in their hats and stuff. I mean, obviously, you could just pause the video and go back and forth and try to figure it out or unscramble them or what have you, but that was actually one of the nicest details that I've seen in some of the character designs is that, you know, and even this goes all the way back to three. I had a strange dream. Ruin. Rehabilitation. What does it mean? Hey. Looks like you're up. Well... Well then, let's go introduce ourselves properly to the staff about your transfer. The school you're attending is in the Aoyama district. It'll cost you a bit to ride the train there, and the route transfers are a pain. I'll drive you there, but just for today. Let's go. Jeez. Jeez. Men aren't usually allowed on my passenger seat. Damn, old man. Give us some- cut us some slack, holy shit. We tried to do something good, and this is the kind of reward we're getting? Wow. Also, where's your hat? Do me a favor and behave yourself, alright? Don't get me wrong. I don't care what happens to you. Jesus don't Christ! Any trouble. Calm your tits, buddy! To reiterate, just so we're clear. You will immediately be expelled if you cause any problems. Oh my god, Honestly, more of this stuff. I hesitated on accepting someone like you. But there were some circumstances on our side. I mean, you I understand that you can't hiding in your hometown. 
but you know, will behave yourself dampen the here. severity of you his actions. But holy school. crap, there man! No place for you to go. Keep that in mind. This is the teacher in charge of your class. I'm Sadayo Kawakami. Here's your student ID. Be sure to read the school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. Kawakami! Woo -woo. By chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. That is your promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa? Mm hmm. He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? There should have been better candidates. The principal almost looks like Humpty was a Dumpty. Transfer, and your class was the only one that had an opening. If you're done explaining things, mind if we get going? I got a store to get back to. Sakura-san, please keep a close Something eye of on note is like I never noticed this the first outside. time I played it, but the background is completely sure like serious talk about the situation. painted and drawn. It's really amazing. <laughs> Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. I kind of like that because that way, like, you can make the, the scenes a lot more detailed than if you were using, like, a 3D model. <sighs> They're treating you like some kind of nuisance. I guess that's what it means to have a criminal record. Turns out your past follows you wherever you go. By the way, if you get expelled now, I won't hesitate to kick you out. You got it? Damn, dude. I'll be careful. <laughs> hmm. School never changes, huh? Hey. Come on. We're going home. What a troublesome situation. <laughs> Jersey wearing teacher. I can't nice. Push someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for this. Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Who knows? It was the principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. It's kind of funny because obviously I'm playing this game right now, but actually going through the you know, the cycle of going through the beginning of this game careful, actually okay. makes me want to play Again, my file, <laughs> you know, which is still I in progress. Like that right Granted, my girlfriend and I beat it on her file twice with a third still, one because she wants to platinum it. But, as a teacher. hey, well, I should be returning it's price. like experiencing it fresh right. the tournament's coming up, with the kinds it? of personas that I <laughs> would want to use. Expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track team too. Yes, that's true. But man, we're, why did it have to be my class? We haven't even been to class yet, and there's already rumors from within the school. Oh, traffic's not moving at all. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. Uh, you said that so at we, home. How was it? The school, I mean. Think you can manage. You said that I am not, you know, you, you're just doing this one time. I was going to take the train anyway, doucheface. It seems fun. <sighs> do you even understand your situation? Of course I do. Still, it's just how I talk. You were expelled once already. I'm Morgan Freeman. <laughs> well, what am I going to do? It's not like anyone will be sympathetic with you. That's what it was like at school. People might say stuff about me in the future, too. What a troublesome kid I've taken in. Why did you take me in? I was asked to do it, and I just happened <laughs> to agree to it. Happened to agree. Uh, I've already been paid for it, too. Wow. A subway has derailed at Shibuya Station, greatly affecting the timetable all across the... Damn. Another accident. Lots of accidents That's lately. so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. You said it, boss. The inbound train will soon be arriving at platform number one. Please wait behind the door. So if you guys have never played like a Persona game before, Persona 5 has a lot of animated cutscenes in the beginning. But most of the cutscenes are actually in-game, which actually is handled pretty damn well. So don't think that this is the norm, okay? 
And that color almost made me think like this was from the Yamanote line in Tokyo. We're experiencing technical difficulties in the lower line. But they know. said lower line, so. Whoa! Like, the way these things are toppling kind of reminds me of, like, Earthquake. You know, the Universal Studios uh, um, tram attraction, if you will. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. No further comments were made. Police are still looking for a plausible motive. It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently Man, all of this six months the shape of his head reminds me of Thanos. Of Holy cow. You guys remember Seems that back like in the beginning of December? Transport both Crazy. Eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. This will go all the way to the top. Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, as well as other recent... Oh, Japanese TV unknown. news. Concern is spreading. I never understood you when I was watching you, but just what could be causing it's such a drastic change so pretty engaging in its own right, even though I couldn't understand anything. That's what you're thinking, correct? How many of you guys have actually been to Japan? Raise your hands. Oh well. I'll count. Are you free? You and I haven't gone for a drink in a while. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. I was I was ready to go for this meeting. That's when this extremely fast train just came crashing in. Oh man, I thought I was gonna die. A noisy subway platform filled with people was suddenly. Hmm. Did you ask for me? Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? You are making a student work late, after all. Conveyor belt only. Huh. What's wrong with conveyor belt sushi? I just so happened to have one nearby that was actually really, really good. We're pretty damn cheap, too. Jeez. Damn, to think there'd be that much traffic. What a waste of time. I wasn't even able to open the cafe today. Well, whatever. Fine. Just head upstairs. There's something I need to give to you. Talk about a gruesome accident. 80 people. Ooh, that's a lot. Forgot how many that that's actually affected. Make sure you write it. You may be under probation. There's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Besides following the law, that is. Mm. However, I'm obligated to report on you, which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. Hey, what's up? I'm about to leave right now. Don't worry. I'll be there in no time. Oh, what's huh? that? Booty call? I'll see you soon. Bow, chicka, bow, wow. Well, I'm off. I'll lock the place up. So do whatever you want for the rest of the night. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. There you go, you more <laughs> more aggro. Better Holy crap. Them, right? I mean, what choice do I have? I should do as I'm told for now. I'm just gonna go to bed. There's no time. I should write down what happened today in my diary. How about no? I have an early day tomorrow. I should rest up. Yeah, we're gonna do that. That ringing sound isn't coming from my cell phone. I hear it coming from downstairs. Uh, I'm gonna go check that, I suppose. Yo, it's me. Who is this? Sheesh, you forgot my voice already? Sakura. Uh, closed up shop, but I forgot to flip the sign to closed. It's too much for a hassle for me to get back. So flip the sign for me. Okay, got it. Well, I'm sure no one's gonna come, even if it says open. Thank goodness I was able to reach you. 
Sorry, I make it a habit to not save guys' numbers on my cell phone. Anyway, I'm glad you answered the phone over in the shop. Okay then, I'm leaving you in charge of the door sign. Okay, let's just uh, frickin' do that, get the hell out, and then get the hell back in. That was easy. I mean, you live down the street. You're, but okay. I guess, I'm not gonna give him crap. Morgan Freeman's a nice dude. Is there anything else I need to do? Sleep. That's exactly what you need to do. I need to take the train to school. Yongen Jaya Aoyama Ichiome. Transfer. It looks like I need to go out to Shibuya, then transfer there. More news about the subway accident. It sounds like a lot of people were hurt. I bet this will affect the timetables for tomorrow, too. That strange app I saw last night is back. It keeps showing up. I thought I erased it. I should probably reboot my phone, just in case. See, that's exactly what I would have done. Thank you. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. Monday. I have school starting today. Hopefully I can get there without getting lost. I don't want to be late on my first day. I should head out now. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go to school, man! Bye! Hey, hold on a minute. Oh, so you actually are going to school. Here, I'll feed you. Just make sure you finish it before the customers start coming in. This is my breakfast. Don't complain, just eat. I can taste complex flavors within the bold spiciness. It's time for you to go. Thanks for the meal. Huh, turns out you do have manners after all. Hurry over to school. You'll end up late if you get lost along the way. Oh boy, I'm not looking forward to- Oh, flip the sign outside- Flip the sign outside to open for me. Got it. Don't forget to do that for me, alright? Now you better on her- <laughs> Better hurry on out. You're gonna be late if you get lost, country boy. So this is technically Tokyo. If he's a country boy, he's obviously not from here. But that's interesting. Let's go to school. Or attempt to. All right, let's take the train here. What? Okay. That'll be fine. I just made my own line. Fantastic. Yeah, I love that I just made my own line and <laughs> this is gonna go in. This guy has no manners whatsoever. There are so many people crammed into this tiny car. Turns out the rumors about the Tokyo subway are true. They're showing the news up on the LA LCD screen. It seems like there are still some lingering effects of yesterday's accident. Maybe the fact that a lot of people are here is because of the accident? Like people are forced to take like different lines and stuff? I mean, just a, just a hunch, right? All right, let's go. Um, where the hell are we supposed to go? What? Somehow I kind of know where to go, maybe? So. The JL ticket gates are just past here. I'm supposed to transfer onto the Ginza line though. It looks like I'm on the wrong side. Well, crap. Can we get out?
Okay, we'll, we'll try. We'll try to get there. Maybe it's this one? Just, just a hunch. I think we're getting there. Sweet. Uh, Ginza line. Yes, okay. I'm gonna catch it, I'm gonna catch it. Yep, so much for a line, suckers! Oh man. Did it say it was going to man, rain? Man, we are ruthless when it comes to those lines. It's raining outside? It just started all of a sudden. This is why I hate the early spring. That reminds me. Did he take an umbrella? I did not, hmm? sir. Who are you talking about? <laughs> Don't mind me. So, what'll it be? One house blend, please. The effects of yesterday's subway accident continues on today as various lines It's tough to make a commentary about the game in general because there's so much serious lately. stuff happening. You know, I mean the subway you know, accident that you can't the news is talking you about. You can't make light of this game, but there's a seriousness that, aside, that prevails throughout the first the several days of this. The accident supposedly went crazy all of a sudden. I heard that some of them suffered from nervous breakdowns during interrogation. Huh. He could care less. He's just like, huh, okay, whatever, man. Aoyama Ichiyome. This is Aoyama Ichiyome. It took some time, but I finally made it. All right, we're going. Going to school. Oh, look at that. Look at that transition. Ah, that music. Great music, great presentation, awesome story. This is like such a crazy package. How many of you guys would actually pick this as your game of the year? You want me to give you Honestly. You're gonna be late. I'm um, sure, thank you. Huh, that's strange. Do you need a lift too? Huh? Nah. Uh. It's the uh, jersey wearing teacher, and she doesn't look too happy. Hmm. The plot thickens. Damn it! Screw that perfect teacher! Perfect teacher? Pervy teacher. You're Morgan Freeman. You shouldn't be saying anything unless I say something. What do you want? You planning on ratting me out to Kamashita? What do you mean? Uh, I mean... What do you mean? <laughs> I messed up there. just now, it was Kamoshida. He does whatever the hell he wants. Who does he think he is, the king of a castle? Vulgar boy. Don't you agree? Yeah, vulgar boy. The king of a castle? No, I, I mean... Hmm? Wait, you don't know Kamoshida? <laughs> Are you for real? You're from Shujin, right? You go to Shujin, too? What? No other high school's got a uniform like this. Huh. A second year, huh? We're the same grade then. Never seen you before, though. It's because I am new. Oh, you a transfer student? Yes. <laughs> then no wonder you don't know him. This rain ain't too bad. We better hurry up or we'll be late. <sighs> Whoa. I feel lightheaded for some reason. Ugh, oh, my head hurts. Damn it. I want to go home. Flash forward? Whoa! 
Such a cool transition, right? Right? Man, if it doesn't want to if this thing doesn't want to make you play the game again or for the first time, I don't know what will. Public calls the psychotic breakdown incidents. I might. You say that like it's none of your business. It was all over the news, and one of the victims included a teacher at your high school. I've no doubt you heard about it. On that day, were you still an ordinary student? What do you mean? Let me change the question. You transferred to Shujin Academy, correct? An ordinary prep school that could be found in any city. That's what it should have been. What happened around that time? Tell me everything, truthfully. We would, but... Guys, unfortunately, this is the end of our tri-play because we are nearing the one hour mark. So, before we continue, I'm going to let this play. But I just want to remind everybody that starting this week, we're going to be releasing videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Once again, that is Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 10 a.m. Pacific Time every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this tri-play. And you guys will actually watch more of these that are coming out, again, Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 10 a.m. And, of course, if you like this video, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing, and leaving a comment below. Because nothing is better than having a conversation about video games and just really the most awesome things about it, right? So, I will leave you with this footage of this really weird castle just kind of coming out of nowhere. And we'll see you guys later. Happy gaming.